Okay, are we ready? Watch out, this, this swing's pretty far. I'm sorry again, Bob. It's my fault. Okay, Jess, go for it. <clears throat> Watch out, dark future. This past is catching up to you! Happy now? Are you kidding? It's been my dream to meet Tatsuki no Henshi in real life. It's been a really popular request lately. You know, I actually had to download episodes of the Bright Future Academy to get the moves right. Anime fans are very passionate and specific about their cosplay fantasies. Did you make a... is... is that a sword? It's a... Time Axe! <laughs> it's what Tatsuki uses to fight off the evil beings from the dark future. We use the 3D printer to make a replica of the one that she borrows from the headmaster of the Bright Future Academy secret school to defeat the evil dark future. Sure. Uh, I don't follow anime. I've never heard of this cartoon. Anime. It's an anime. A cartoon is a western style of animation with a slightly more realistic feel to it. Anime is more exaggerated. Shouldn't you be recording sound, not making it? He was just explaining No, I stopped how... caring, stopped talking. Where is Steven? Is he mopping around Sarah's office again? I need to charge my last client double. The sun joined in, made it a family affair. Gross. Expensive. Okay, Jess, here's your time with... Oh, hey, everyone. Hey, did you, you know, know that I was just explaining to Bob and Jimmy right? that, that the Bright Future Academy is really Okay, okay, oh, okay. Did you know one, that? one at a time. Um, Madison. Yes. I need you to charge my last client for a West Virginia coal mine. Got it. Is that it? It doesn't have to be. What? Oh, oh god. No, no, no. Ha ha. Hands. <laughs> well, if you change your mind, you know where I'll be. Okay. Bye, Jess. Bye, Madison. What just happened? Madison just rubbed your... Yes, okay. I was there. Okay. Um, do you have everything you need for your call? Time Axe! Check! Time Whip! Check! Time to bring the dark future into check! Me! Scream! <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Okay. Yes. Got him! What? what? What did you get? Even though it took me 30 minutes for my programming to readjust, I really think I'm gonna stand out. What did you get? Pussy hands! Oh, they're so pretty. They they actually look just like mine. Oh god. Now who authorized this? Did did Kenneth say you can get these? The guy said this would make me more competitive, especially since the new hardware isn't compatible with Kawasaki vagina hands. Wow, they look great. You know what? Maybe when I get back we can practice no fives. Sure thing? No thing. No no. Jess, go on your call. Now, how did you pay for those? Well, my last call was in cash, so I swung by Sal's. He really does do great work. I told you he was gonna do it. <laughs> oh, I must be becoming more human because I'm really starting to pity you, man. Did you two talk him into this? Oh, he didn't talk him into doing anything. <laughs> the way I remember it is he heard everything from Adam. Mm -hmm. And our memories are strong. You have got to stop ripping your shirts. That's like half of our budget. It's not our fault that our skin repels cotton and Brandon can't comprehend hyperbole. Well, if you'll excuse me, I need to put pads in my palms before I start to cycle. That's not how those work. Actually, the Kawasaki hand vaginas, they cycle in two modes, stigmata and passion of the Christ. You know, if you want to get your Lady Macbeth on. Uh, we've got to knock. Steven, we knock on someone's door before we come in. I mean, not me, but most people anyhow. <laughs> All right, um... You what? <laughs> if you just came in here to watch me and Adam sleeping together, well, I'm gonna have to charge you like any of the other clients. No, I'm... I'm sorry, I'll, I'll knock next time. Was that it? No. 
Sal, we need to call Sal to remove a pair of um, uh, pussy hands uh, from Brandon. A pair of what? The pussy hands. I don't remember authorizing anyone to get pussy hands. You didn't. Uh, Brandon got the idea from- I don't remember authorizing anyone to get any ideas either. I'll rectify it. I'm sorry to have bothered you. That's fine. Go along, Stephen. Now, Adam, where were we? You know, I'm not getting enough erection out of you. Oh! You know, I never would have authorized this. Yeah, maybe, maybe not. I remember Adam coming in here not too long ago for an upgrade. Hey, where is he? Real nice kid. I'd like to say hi. He's busy. Uh, He's got a call. That's a shame. That's a shame. Hey, you know what's a shame? Is undoing such fine work. Yes, yeah, Sal. You, you did a real great job of giving a confused sex bot useless fuck hands. Hey, hey! Look who got a visit from the testicle dropping fairy. Sorry, I didn't mean to snap. But... Snap? That wasn't snapping, kid. Look, I was married for 12 years to five different women. Okay? You haven't been snapped at until a woman uses a baby as a figurative and literal weapon against you. Now, who were you trying to snap at? Adam. Kath. Sarah, to a certain extent. Ah, trouble in paradise. Yeah, this, this isn't paradise. So oh, it isn't? No. Oh, you don't have a, a roof over your head? Well, I mean, yeah, but... Did you have to sell off any of your AI family? No, but... Hmm. Did you have to have your doctor explain to you why your penile enlargement didn't take? No. Yeah, go ahead, laugh. My balls are so tiny that they cannot hold a larger shaft. Ah. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what it is. Say, hey, science. But you know what, kid? I got giant balls where it counts. My heart. I also got them all over my table because I ordered too many from Oriental Trade. <laughs> you see, kid? Life is never too hard that you can't just laugh. I mean, I don't know what's got you all willy shakes up in here, but you gotta look at what you got in the wind column. No, it's just hard. Hard? No, that's not hard. The vaginal fluid that's dripping out all over this pussy head, that's hard. It's like concrete trying to chip away at this, okay? Look, life is like pussy hands. Sometimes you get fucked all the way up to the elbow joint. But at the end of the day, they're just hands. The hands can hold everything together. You just gotta know what to reach out and grab. You just gotta be very careful with these hands because they're very sensitive. Thanks, Sal. Don't mention it, kid. Now get over here and help me take this pussy hand off. Okay, on three. One. Two, three. Oh, we got it. Whew. Oh, these are always so hard to get off.